So board one of uh, week four uh, of six is uh, a, a one which we discussed at the time and it was a four spade opener by North. Pass, 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 because there's not really anything anybody can do. Maybe West could bid 4 no Trump for the minors, but I think four spades play, played is normal. Now, a lot of people led the Ace of Hearts. And on the lead of the Ace of Hearts, West should throw a small club, indicating that he wants a diamond. So that when a diamond is switched, West can get the Ace and the Queen, because a lot of people ended up giving the king of diamonds to the dummy and not beaten the contract by enough tricks. So four spades minus two should have been what happened. Five diamonds we think might make, but there's a lot of transportation issues between the two hands. So four spades opening with eight spades and that amount of losers and that amount of points and at that vulnerability, opening four spades is absolutely normal and the right thing to do. So board two is a common theme we have running through opening preemptively. Several people opened two or three diamonds. I don't like it because the quality of the suit is so bad. And if you do open two or three diamonds, how is your partner supposed to know what to do? They have a good card in diamonds. They have a five card major and they have 14 high card points. So anything could be possible. But as I've said before, I don't like opening first or second in hand with those suits. Now, if East West does, if, 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 uh, Sorry, if East passes, it's likely going to go pass, pass, one spade. And North might stick in two hearts again. And the only reason why it might happen is because their partner's a passed hand. But the quality of the suit isn't great. That might go pass. And now South is going to raise to three hearts. And that's probably where you're going to play. And you're going to lose with proper defense, two spades, one club and two hearts, and you'll go one off. But if East opens some number of diamonds, they don't have enough tricks to be able to make what they want to make. They're going to end up too high. So board three, for a change, we have a reasonably non-competitive uh, auction. And uh, I do believe South should open one heart on this hand. Pass, two diamonds. Game forcing hand, you can always start off by bidding your suit. Pass. Two hearts from South. Don't need to bid two spades because that's bidding above the barrier, showing a reverse value hand. You don't have it in shape and you don't have it in points. Now, North could bid three no Trump at this stage because two hearts doesn't promise six hearts. And three no Trump is now an offer to play. But if South has three six hearts, they can correct to four hearts so that you play in three no Trump by North. Now, the likely lead is a club lead. And unless the defence is alert, three no Trump is going to make Four hearts should not make. Four hearts is off on two hearts, one spade and the ace of diamonds because West has queen 10, small, small, queen 10, seven, in fact, and nine, eight. So look at the pips. So four hearts should not be made by north, south. But you know, Trump is likely going to make, make because when you lead the first trick, win the first trick cheaply in, in your hand with the 10 of clubs, you're going to drive out the ace of spades. And unless you're alert and win the ace of spades and switch a heart, three no Trump is going to make. And that's difficult to do. I don't think anybody beat three no Trump that was in it. So three no Trump without a fit and without the values and opening with 11 points is acceptable. 
when you have the right shape, the rule of 20, seven losers, and all your points are in your suits, no singleton honours anywhere. Uh, that's there to type a hand you can open on 11 points. So board four was again an uncontested auction and again shows the power of long suits. Slam is on this hand and makes pretty much on any lead. But uh, I think only one pair, John and Michael, got to slam on an interesting auction. It went one diamond from west, pass from north, two clubs from east, pass from south, frozen out. Three no trump from West, showing a strong no trump in effect. Not not unreasonable, even though you have six diamonds. You could equally bid three diamonds, in which case East can now bid three hearts. But three no trump does the job. And Michael jumped to six clubs with the power of a seven card suit. And it went pass, pass, pass. So the hand on lead led the ace of hearts, which is not a bad stab. And it went 10. And they switched to the 10 of spades. Trying to, trying to sneakily put them under pressure. But there's no problem. So they flew the ace. And Michael quite correctly now realized that his contract depended on the club finesse. And led a club to the queen. And crossed his fingers and toes. And when the nine appeared, he overtook the diamond. Because that's less likely to be roughed. And he refinessed the club. And his last two losers on hearts go on the king and queen of diamonds. He draws the ace of clubs first. And leads the heart to the king. The king of diamonds throwing a heart and then claims. So nicely bid. Six no trump is the same contract. So in match points, maybe six no trump is where you want to be because you need your partner to have the controls that they have anyway. And I don't think on the values that you're likely to be missing a control, particularly with a jump of three no trump rebid by West. So a good bit of six clubs. So board five was an interesting hand in that when you're looking at all 52 cards, there is a way you can make slam. Many people bid it, which is very good because getting to slam on this hand shows excellent judgment, even if you didn't make it. You've got a power, powerful hand between the two hands. So the auction went at a couple of tables and should go something like this. One heart from north, pass. One spade from south, pass. Three diamonds, a game-forcing jump rebid, showing five hearts, four diamonds, pass. Three hearts from south, stronger than jumping to four hearts, setting up a cue bidding sequence. Three spades, first round control, agreeing hearts, pass. Four clubs, first round control, agreeing, and uh, that's showing the ace of clubs. Four diamonds, first round control, showing diamonds. Four hearts, slowing down now. And I think at that point, North has enough to bid four no trump, find out that they're missing the first round control and then just bid six hearts. Five clubs showing one or four. Six hearts is enough now. Now, most people went down that were in six hearts and I can understand why because we don't know spades or divide six nil. So at some point you lead a spade to your king as you're roughing your diamonds. But we'll show you the double dummy way with which you can make it. Let's say East leads his club. We rise with the ace. And we rough a club. And we play the ace of diamonds. And the queen of diamonds. It doesn't matter whether they cover or don't cover. If they don't cover, we discard. And if they cover, we rough. 
most people covered. Now, this is the point where people let a spade to the king, and that's why they go down. But if you rough another club, and play jack of diamonds, and rough a diamond, you can even afford to rough high. Now you lead a heart to the 10. And what do they do? There's nothing they can do. You're going to make your contract. But as I said, most people lead a spade to the king. Therefore, it goes down. 